what's up it's Jackie okay I have a haul to share with you um this is like the second part of the little haul that I just did um I kind of took a little break from filming to get the house clean and ready for um back to school so in that time I obviously did not stop shopping stop stop I can stop speaking though right now probably um <laughs> So yes, of course, I never stopped shopping, and I was continuing to pick stuff up and kind of stockpiling everything in here to be able to share with you, and I am so excited to do so. Okay, so, <clears throat> excuse me, I've been on a little nail polish kick, and I think I'm kind of reaching the end of my nail polish obsession. Partially, probably, be partially, probably, because... <laughs> I've probably bought like every single color that's owned in life now, but I just figured why the heck not? Let's just buy every remaining color. So first of all, I picked up some things from the Sally Hansen Insta Dry. I picked up two colors. This is in Peachy Breeze. And this one is in Jade Jump, which kind of matches my scarf. Um, then I picked up this from the Wet n Wild, um, their Mega Last collection, and this is called Through the Grapevine, which I've had like a super obsession with purple polishes, if you've been watching me. And then I also got this. This is from Sonia Kashuk, and I've never tried anything from her line, and I figured, well, these were on sale, so I figured I would start with this, also matching my scarf. Um, and this is in the shade Breakfast at Tiffany's. So, I thought I would give that a go. Um, next. Okay. So, I saw these swatched. I think the first person that I saw swatch these was Melissa Raymond. Um, on her channel, Milani sent her, like, the entire line of these. And I was so intrigued, and I really liked the color selection. So, I picked up four of these. These are by Milani. Um, and these are their new... Bella Eyes Gel Powder Shadow. Um, I got it in four different shades. This one is in Bella Cafe. This one is in Bella Rouge. one is in Bella Espresso. Really pretty rich brown. And then this one ugh, is maybe my favorite. And this one is in the shade Bella Purple. So they have like that indentation like the Maybelline um, bouncy blushes do and you would kind of think that they're um you know at first glance that you could push in on them a little bit but they're not they are a solid you know powder formula but they're beautifully creamy and really really pigmented and they didn't have the full line out at my CVS they only had a select um number on a little you know side display so I picked those up I know there's some girls in my place well with makeup girl group that are looking for some so I've kind of been on the lookout for the colors that they want also um I saw Emily Noel talk about this she actually used this in her full face Milani tutorial and ever since I saw her use it I've been really wanting to get it I can't open it um this is the Milani Bronzer XL All Over Glow. So it's a really nice, sorry that the light of my, my light is reflecting off of it. But it's a, you know, split pan of two different shades of bronzer. You got a little bit of a warmer, lighter one over here, and then a little bit of a cooler one. This will be great for contouring. Um, so I'm really excited to use that. I also bought from Milani. Um, I've been wanting this shade of their baked blush. This is in the shade um, Luminoso, which is a really pretty um, pinky, peachy color. I wanted to get that. And then I saw this from Rimmel, and I'm thinking this is new because I haven't ever seen this before, but maybe it's not. Maybe I just don't know what I'm talking about. Um, this is the Salon Pro 
with Lycra, and this is in the shade New Romantic. Yes, I know, another nail polish. Need that like I need a hole in my head, but whatever. <laughs> so then I went to Walgreens, and our Walgreens are usually pretty late about putting special editions displays out so I kind of walked around I was looking for the new snow white display by elf and I couldn't find it I'm cashing out and I asked the girl behind the counter I said do you know if you guys had that and she was so sweet she scoured the whole store for me we finally found it which it was in a really obvious location truth be told I should have found it but I didn't so I picked up um three of the things from the little line I went ahead and got the lip collection, which if you're on my plays well with makeup group, um, I did post a picture of me wearing, this is their lip stain, which um, is like a marker type of product. Then they come a lip gloss in here, then they come, please speaking. Then you get a lip gloss in here and then you also get um, a tinted lip balm, which is fantastic. Everything has the little snow white emblem on it, which is absolutely gorgeous. Um, then you also, I picked up the eye collection, which comes with their lengthening mascara. And then you're getting a little six pack of shadows in there. And the last thing I picked up was their beauty book, which the packaging on this just I love it so that is what it looks like on the outside you open it up it's you know has the little mirror in here on this side and then you're getting a nice variety of shadows and lip products and you know blush and everything so it's really like I think I think this one of them was ten dollars and the other two were five dollars a piece so I can't remember Maybe this was the $10 one, the beauty book, and then these were five bucks a piece. Um, they did have a maybe one or two more things that were in the collection that I didn't pick up, but I thought those looked the best. And that is it. That is my little haul. Well, big haul, and of course, I'll want to go shopping more, but you guys enjoy your day, and I'll see you later. Bye.